Hi, I'm meteorologist Carrie Rose here at WTVR CBS 6 in Richmond, Virginia. As you can see behind me, we have a live view. Cameras provide excellent information of what's going on outside, but we need a little bit extra help from space. And this is a combination of satellite, which you can see portrayed here, clouds in the white, combined with what we can tell at the ground from radar data. Richmond there into the center of your map. But we're just one piece of a much larger puzzle. So let's go ahead and look at what's going on across the entire eastern U.S. And you might think, ooh, that's an interesting looking storm system. It is. That's Tropical Storm Isaac. And we've been able to follow Isaac's progression closer to the U.S. because we've been watching it since it was way out over the open waters of the Atlantic Ocean. And this is crucial not only in the Atlantic through the Caribbean and the Gulf, but also out into the Pacific for us to be able to get an understanding of what's going on with storm systems like this one as well, because what's missing? land, land observations. And so you can from space look down onto the earth and get a good idea of the structure of what's happening with a system like Tropical Storm Isaac. You can even just start to see a little bit of an eye trying to form here in this lapse. So this is really great information. And from satellites, you can detect some of the necessary ingredients for tropical systems or hurricanes. For example, sea surface temperature. We can tell that from satellite data, what the winds are doing at different altitudes or heights above the ground, what those temperatures are like, what the moisture content is, its location uh, in the earth away from the equator. And then if there is a disturbance in the atmosphere that can help generate something like Isaac. So what you're looking at here is a blend where you can, oh yeah, start to see some of the opening up of an eye while trying to form. And you can also see, as I mentioned, this is an infrared view of the storm. So satellites are really important to letting us understand what happens to a tropical system before it's a threat to land.